We interrupt our programming to bring you the following special report. The Ryan Report. Whatever opinion they had ain't gonna change nothing I'm doing. What was the story he told? Because I, I was there. It's time for the Ryan Report. It's like Jay-Z, all eyes on us. On the People Station, V103. This is your Ryan Report right here on the People Station, V103. Brought to you by McDonald's. Headed to McDonald's this morning. And ask them, do y'all have two delicious egg McMuffins for only $3? And they'll be like, yep. McDonald's, I'm loving it. Oh, look who's loving their wife. Oh, my gosh. Antoine L. Cook. Cook the Bondsman on Twitter. Going on Facebook and Instagram because now that he and Fantasia are over, he's saying that his wife is ride or die. Yeah, this is the guy who cheated on his wife, got Fantasia pregnant. They were even together at some moment. While his wife was pregnant. Okay, I didn't know Remember that part. Remember at the end, he okay. left her because she was already pregnant. Well, that one, because Fantasia admitted him. to having, she had an abortion by him at one point in time. And this is their second time they she actually had the baby. Right. Yeah, so it's a deep relationship, but they're no longer together. He's back with his wife. He goes on Facebook and says, say what you want on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, any social sites. But this B has row with me through thick and thin. I don't care what you say. The original Bonnie and Clyde. This is my boo thing. He said boo thing. My wifey, I can't. Can't get enough. I'm mad at her for taking him back. I really am. I really am. I feel like he won. He got the baby by Fantasia, and then he gets his wife back. <laughs> I don't know if it's winning, but I mean, I just fe- would wonder why she would want him back. Why would Why would you want him back after he hold it- up the picture? Okay. You know how they always yeah. analyze body language, crash. Yeah. Look at the picture. Look at the space between him and this woman. Yeah. Yep. This woman's face is saying like, "I'm gonna take this picture." But every hair salon, every grocery store, yeah. everywhere she goes, people know that he left her for Fantasia and then came back. Like he worked at the cell phone store. <laughs> T-Bubble, they say. <laughs> and now he's back like, it's all good. It ain't all good. I know. No, it's not. He worked at the cell phone store? Yeah. But then they had a family together. So it's kind of, I don't, uh, I'm not married, so it's hard for me to speak in this situation. But to me personally, looking at it, I hate the fact that she took him back. Yeah, you don't have to be married to identify with this one. This is wrong on every level. You, you're a fool, lady. He is attractive. I think that's. Oh, what's oh, oh no! I think that's not attractive. I think that yeah, he's making attractive though. babies all over town. Yeah, I think that's why she took him back. He's cute. <laughs> that's, that's, horrible. that's stupid. Now moving wow. on from him. Woof. <laughs> look at that look on Mo's face. Like you just ate a lemon. <laughs> no, I'm with you, Mo, but you know, sometimes women take them back if they're attractive. I mean, if you would have said he's a billionaire, then I could have understood. Oh, that's coming up. That is coming up. That is coming up. Lisa Ray and the gold digger. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. I'm just she kidding. And, no, you're not. Uh, Sister to Sister kidding. Magazine, uh, Jamie Foster Brown, get into it about the gold digger. But let's move on okay. now. Uh, in the words of, uh, you know, Living Color. Are you wrong, Twan? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's move on to uh, Jay-Z. Yeah. Who some people are saying is wrong because he's just insert person that everyone's talking about in song now. Okay, so in, in, um, in LA, he did a tribute to Nelson Mandela. Let's take a listen. We want to dedicate this song to Nelson Mandela. Let that great man sweet stand as an example of what you can do. The song is forever young, but he's getting flack because that's a song he was he used to dedicate to Trayvon Martin, and we have the audio to the Trayvon Martin dedication. I'm not mad at it personally. Jay Z's out of hand. I mean, you know, there's other audio that's coming up. More and more stuff is coming out. I couldn't find it, but you go way, way back. He's like, shout out to Django. <laughs> what? No. He was a slave. He freed himself. No. He burned down the house. <laughs> <laughs> Django lives. <laughs> right. Whatever, Django. So he just puts anybody in. There. Right. He, he doesn't care. He does it. 721. I'm still going to see the show at Phillips Arena because I'm going. I want to go. Right. But you're wrong, Jesse. <laughs> That's your right report right here is V103. And if you don't know, now you know, you know, you know. The Ryan Report. The Ryan Report. V103.